Hello, hello, hello. Time yes to roll. Welcome, welcome, babies. If you are new here, welcome back. If you are returning, meet me at the altar. It's playing right now. Um, your divine person may want to meet you at the altar. We're going to do a divine connection read. So come on in, my loves. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit. And get comfortable because we about to make it do what it do. The smoke alarm will be. The planes will fly over and be loud as shit. I sing, I curse. If any of this is going to be a problem, now is the time for you to click off. If not, go ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to hit the subscription button, guys. Um, we're trying to get to 2,500 subscribers here. It'll be two years that I've had this channel next month. Um, so if we can get to 2,500, just 2,500, I'd be happy with that for this channel. Um, it would be greatly appreciated, babies, okay? Um, so please hit the subscription button, like and share, so we can get the, the videos out to the algorithms well, okay? Um, next 72 hours for Divine Connections. My personals are open. The shop is open. The links to my other channels are all below. Next 72 hours for Divine Connections. Seven of Cups. Someone can either be coming out of some type of confusion or somebody's finding out about somebody else's other choices. They have multiple options here. What's going on next 72 hours for Divine Connections? Yes, yeah, so there could be an empress here finding out that... Um, Someone that we're dealing with is uh, putting them in a third-party situation here. Your intuition could have been telling you this, Divine Femme. Yeah, and you're putting your guard up here. So you may be defending yourself or blocking somebody out. Blocking someone's offer. This, um, this weekend over the next 72 hours because this person put you in a third party. Or they're still putting you in third-party situations. Clarify the Seven of Cups. Ace of Wands. Yeah, this person out here passing out the dang thing to everybody. They're going to come in here and tell you they want to pass in a new beginning. But they're still giving it to everybody here. Clarify Empress Energy here. The Empress Energy with the Empress Energy in reverse. Okay? So, yeah. um, This person's out here still dealing with a karmic-ass energy here. They still giving dick to this karmic ass energy. And your intuition has possibly been telling you this. Clarify the high priestess here. There's a king of cups, a karmic king of cups here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. That is still dealing with a karmic ass energy here. A karmic ass feminine. It'll be a baby's mother or mother. But they're still having sex. They're still having a connection. They're still having third-party situations. They're going to come back towards you and want to present you with some type of offer here. But, yeah, they still they still low vibration on here, babies. Yeah, nine of swords. This is just going to bring you a lot of stress and heartache. Spirit said block this. Yeah, this person just wants to give you an offer to hold on to you. They want to put you in competition. Manipulation games. Yeah, remain single. Nine of coins. They want to come give you an offer because they don't want you to, to be single anymore. They want to hold on to you, but they're, they're not going to give to you. They're going to still put you in third-party situations. Yeah, Spirit says it's time to close out that cycle here. Yeah. Um, this is going to be somebody you have a soul connection this is divine connection anyway but I, I feel like you should choose the other lover you have another choice coming in in lovers and it's not this one spirit says be patient okay there is another option when it comes to your your divine connections that's coming in for you and it's not this one this, this is a divine connection I feel like you have a soul tie with whoever this person is but this person is still in lower negative ass energy here they're still dealing with karmic ass people. Okay. Somebody that's bitchy, lazy, angry. Yeah, karmic energy for sure. Judgment is being served. This could be your twin. Your twin could be possibly trying to come back this weekend. 
just to keep you from moving on because they haven't released this karmic. What's coming in for our divine connections over the next 72 hours? So you have a twin flame, a twin ray, a high level soulmate, somebody that's returning, somebody that you walked away from here. Somebody that put you in third party situations. And they see you as the empress here. They see you as a divine counterpart. But they're still in this lower ass negative ass energy here. They're still dealing with lower negative ass energies. And if you go back towards this person or you let your guard down. When it comes to this person here. They're going to just have you all stressed out. All in your head. Can't eat. Can't sleep. Yeah, Spirit says remain single when this person comes in with this offer here. What's coming in for the next 72 hours for Divine Connections? Yeah, it's time to close out this cycle. Okay, you have brand new beginnings and goals and completing cycles for sure. The world is in your hands and at your feet. You got a solid new offer and possibilities coming. So, not with this, okay? Close out this cycle because you got something new coming in here. Um... What's coming in is going to bring you a sense of worthiness and belonging. You will feel loved by others and this person will be grateful for you. This person here is not. This person is coming towards you is under judgment. Okay? They're being judged for their actions in the past. Their choices. Okay? They're now checking themselves in this self-evaluation here. Yeah, see? Spirits has closed this cycle out or you're going to end up being the wounded warrior. It's time for you to take the last stand and show your backbone. It's time for you to be on guard and be on the lookout. Okay, Real, realize your past mistakes when, when it came to this person, to this connection here. Okay, you put in a lot of hard work and you haven't had it easy. So why would you go back to this connection here where this person is finna just drag you back down where you've already came out of? They haven't healed. They haven't done the work. Yeah, you're going to have to make a choice. A conscious decision here, what you're going to do when this person comes towards you. I feel like you have feelings for this person because there's a soul connection here. But this person is still in lower negative energy, okay? Spirit says you need to be preparing and making plans for your future, okay? Um, discovering and making the progress moving forward. You have new opportunities with a partnership coming in. You just need to wait on the next step, okay? Um, continue to set your romantic goals and ideas. Continue to manifest that. But it's not this... It's not this soul counterpart or divine connection from your past. Look, you're being overlooked here. No acknowledgement. Things are not going to turn out the way you thought. Okay, wishes are going to turn into nightmares. Unable to love or receive love. Misery loves company. This person is, is unable to receive love. Okay, they're miserable. This is why they're with the karmic. This is why they're investing in the karmic. Because they're both miserable. They both came out in reverse. They both miserable. You upright. You upright empress and you listen to your intuition here, Divine Film. Both of these motherfuckers is down here in reverse. And all they got is sex. That's it. So let this move on. This person's going to come back, but they're going to still be dealing with whoever this third party baby mama whoever it's. Let that shit go. You're finna manifest a brand new beginning. Yeah, you have a new soul connection coming in here. Um, but Spirit says you need to put an end to this connection here. Death. There was some type of soul connection here. But it's time to put an ending to this investment. You're manifesting a new connection. Yeah, this is somebody from your past that's gonna try to come back. But they're still dealing with their past. They're still dealing with an ex-lover, an ex-friend, an ex-family member. Yeah, it's still lying, sneaky deceptiveness here. They're plotting and scheming. Okay, they're being deceptive, sneaky, dangerous, risky behavior. They're playing mind games. Yeah, they're going to come in and tell you they want to build a connection with you, but it's about money. They're coming in for money here. This person been watching you and stalking you. Okay, they see you coming up. They just want a piece of what you got here. So what's coming back towards you over this this next 72 hours is a divine connection. Um, but this person is not your person. 
person still, like I said, third party still got a lot of confusion. They have not healed or done the work. Spirit says, do not allow this. Even though you have a connection to this person, do not allow this person back in. You're going to have to make a choice or decision, though. And if you choose to allow this person back in, it's going to bring the wounded warrior. You're going to end up hurt again. You need to move forward and remain single right now. What's meant for you is coming. There is an investment in a connection, a soul connection coming your way if you make the right choice. Close off this cycle. It's time to put an ending to this. There's a new beginning transformation coming in over the next 72 hours. Okay, babies? So if it resonates with you, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, my loves, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, my TT babies.